Hi guys, if anyone's watching, this is my vlog and today I'm going to tell you about how I celebrated my birthday all by myself. So this is not all about my birthday, I mean, I'm just going to talk about what I ate for my birthday. So let's start. Okay, so breakfast, for breakfast I thought I'd have my favorite breakfast food which is eggs scrambled eggs to be precise but i didn't know how to i mean i didn't know how to make scrambled eggs so i looked up uh, on youtube for a tutorial and this is me preparing scrambled eggs for the first time in my life i'm putting some oil on the pan i have uh, I had my eggs beaten. And uh, very carefully I'm putting my eggs to the pan because I'm still very, very scared of the induction cooker. By the way, so far I didn't have any accidents. And uh, in the tutorial, this is how they instruct to move the spatula from the periphery of the, of the egg to the center. I'm not sure whether I did it correctly because at the end, uh, the, the appearance of my scrambled eggs were a little bit off. But taste-wise, it was okay. I mean, good. So, I'm not really um, too fussy about appearance, so it was fine. And I know, since I'm so not used to cooking, it'll take some time for me to get familiarized with this, as to how to handle these spoons and spatulas and everything. Still, I'm very clumsy. So, this is me struggling to put the egg back to my plate <laughs> I know it look it looks like a mess but it tasted good really I was happy with what I made for myself okay So I'm adding some salt and pepper. And voila! My scrambled eggs. <laughs> so with eggs, I decided I'd have some muesli because eggs are not enough. And I need a, I need a big breakfast. I get hungry very easily, so... And muesli is my, perhaps, the second or the third favorite breakfast option. I love muesli. I'm grateful for uh, that person who invented this muesli thing. <laughs> and I think I can eat muesli as much as I want. And I'm adding some yogurt. I know I'm supposed to do this uh, in the previous night and keep it overnight or whatever, but I always keep forgetting it and I never plan my meals. But maybe I should. We'll see in the future. Okay, so yeah, that was my birthday breakfast. Okay, moving on to the lunch. So I decided I'd have chicken for my lunch. So by the way, this is not my first time cooking chicken in my new kitchen. Um, I did uh, it once, but I didn't have time to edit my video. So I'll be, I'll be preparing another video about that about that adventure of me preparing chicken for the first time so yep 
This is me preparing chicken for the second time. I'm adding some salt, pepper and some spices. So I really need to get those spices absorbed to my chicken because that's how it will taste good. And I'm adding more salt because I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm never certain because I'm, I don't know, I have to experience, experiment with these quantities of spices and stuff. And now I'm adding some oil to the pan. And then I'm going to um, switch on the induction cooker very carefully. And I'm adding some onions and garlic. And some chili powder. Mixing it. So you have to mix it until your garlic and the onions are like golden. And then I'm switching it off because I'm still a novice at this thing. I'm not confident enough to do, do it in one go. I'm adding the chicken. And now this is the beginning of my misfortunes. You guys, uh, something happened to the uh, back cover of my phone. So, yeah. And... Um, that's when things started to crumble. And I have added some water. And switched it on. I'm going to boil the chicken. Meanwhile, I'm concerned about my phone. So yeah, yeah. So that was the uh, end of my clip because I had to stop recording. Anyway, my chicken got burnt, and I had beans and potatoes for my lunch. Well, that's okay. I mean, it was good. <laughs> and then I had uh some cake for my dessert because it was my birthday and I didn't buy a whole cake because it was just me and I knew I I had nobody to share, share the cake with and I have I cannot eat a cake by myself I mean not just now I'm not used to eat, eating sweet food so yeah, maybe next year we'll see about it. So anyway, it was a really nice piece of cake. I enjoyed it very much because it was such a long time since I had a, a piece of cake, I think. So yes, uh, maybe for my next birthday, I'll I'll cut a proper cake and maybe do a mukbang. We'll see. <laughs> and for desserts, uh, I mean, after desserts, I had guava. 
and because of my bad memories about my lunch, I opted for pizza for dinner. <laughs> I didn't record it because I didn't have the mood. So yeah, that's it.